Hey, this is Nerfman 101 with another vid. I'm not sure if my batteries are die because they're rechargeable batteries and they work pretty well, so I recommend that you use them. But I haven't recharged them, so I gotta hurry up. Basically, I'm tired. I've stayed until 4 o'clock in the morning. It's like 11 something now, so that. But anyway, it's all about my long shot right now. Uh, I thought about something last night because I was so tired. I was like, hmm, I wonder if you could do this. So, this is what I did. I was wondering if you can load the gun with your stock instead of loading it with this right here, this part, or the forearm grip. So I figured I would try something new. I taped it off and surprisingly it works pretty well. So, uh, <laughs> but the tape just broke so I can't even show you right now. Uh, so I recommend anyone who feels like trying use tape and try it out right quick and then if you really like it glue it because I don't want to mess up your guns if you don't like it so also uh, what else I used the top part of the first gun that was right here and saw that and just reused it in here put it on and taped it and now it slides and crap also uh, oh yeah front gun integration that's what I'm doing with this gun uh, it's taped off for now just because I'm holding it in place, but uh, I'll glue it and all this stuff later, shortly, I guess. I'm not really sure if we have the glue, but uh, uh, I really love this gun. So hopefully when it's done, it'll look nice. And also, leave a comment if you know how to fill in right here because I want it to look like it's just going straight down, clean, crisp, and nice. <laughs> So after I respray paint it, I'll show you all how it looks after it's done. And like UN-13, I'll probably have fishing line or something going through the gun. And then I have to drill something right here. And then I'll have the little thing to pull it down and shoot the gun. So I'll have that set up shortly, I guess. And also, I'm thinking about selling it. So anyone interested, go ahead and comment me, please. Because... I'm not sure if I'm going to sell on eBay or not, but, man, I don't really like this gun. <laughs> but I'll show, of course, I'll show it to you when it's done, and just give me a comment if you're interested. It will have the front gun integration, the clip removal thing is gone, so you can just take out your clip even if you're loaded. Uh, what else? Uh, hurry. Uh, oh, spring. That restrictor's taken out, and I stretch out the spring. I didn't add another spring. So, once this gun is modded, you probably don't want to open it up again because the front gun will be glued on and everything. So, if that's a turn off for you, then I recommend you don't buy it, but it's still a pretty good gun, I think. Just, especially to be stalking, just a stretch out spring and air stripper removal. I forgot how much it gets. I haven't done a range stress in a while, so. Uh, but yeah, uh, this is my gun. If you're interested, give me a comment. If you know how to fill in these gaps, give me a comment. If you just want to comment, give me a comment. I don't care. Subscribe, please. This is Nerfman101 saying sorry, nar.